This video is your presentation of Hemispherics Bioform, brought to you by AlpineStocks.com. It's an AMEX listed stock, trading our ticker HEB. Very strong move over recent months, from May lows around a quarter, all the way up to peak out at $1.10 in the late part of September. Stock's consolidated since then, but making a small ascending triangle. This is one we're going to keep on radar for continuation to break through a resistance point here at $0.85. Cents. See the MACD after the retracement? Dipped a little bit below zero, but not too far. Nice upward trend since, holding over top of zero now. Bullish cross recently happened. It's a strong look to the trend of the MACD, holding over top of zero for the so-called money line. It's a good indication that this chart's going to continue to see upward pressure. PPO in a similar position. ADX has cooled well off from those highs, down low. Given the earliest hints, it's going to start a new uptrend. Although it's in a pretty neutral spot at this point, plenty of upside potential. Money flow index has turned back upward. Firmly over top of 50, showing people are paying higher prices for the stock. This accumulation distribution dropping off. I don't particularly care for that look. I want to see this start to find a bottom, turn itself upward. Because even though higher prices are being paid for the stock, this accumulation distribution dropping off tells me that there's more selling going on than buying. And that's reinforced by this shake in money flow, pulling down around negative 0.3. That also says over the last 20 periods, selling pressure has been outweighing buying pressure. Now per the CCI. That break of 100 is a buy point. Full stows holding over top of 50, showing momentum is being sustained in the play. And the Trix is trending upward, and importantly over top of zero. That's a bullish look as well. RSIs, all three components over top of 50. It's a bullish sign of momentum, and a position that I want to see hold. Now as I referenced at the beginning of the video, the chart's taking on the look of an ascending triangle over about the last six weeks. I want to see those higher lows continually be made, and this support level about 75 cents be held. Moving averages are all tucked in underneath it. Price per share is over top of the 50-day moving average and well over top of the 200-day moving average. Those are all bullish signs. Now the key point for this chart is to break through that 85 cent resistance. If it does break out, I suspect it's probably going to come up here and challenge at least this $1 area, which is always a psychological barrier, but potentially even these old highs at $1.10. Volume is not an issue at all. 5.4 million shares traded. There's plenty of liquidity in this stock. Now as a technical stock to watch, we're going to keep this on radar to take out this resistance point and possibly not some nice gains up to the next level of resistance. Those are the type of things that I'd be looking for in the HEB chart, but as always, merely my interpretation. I'm not a financial consultant. Strongly encourage you to do your own property due diligence. It's all a qualified financial advisor before making any investment decisions. Past performance is not a guarantee of future results. Please visit the AllPennyStocks.com site to do the full disclaimer disclosure and do not base any investment decisions on any material found on the website and or video chart. No person employed by AllPennyStocks is a registered investment advisor or licensed broker-dealer. Thank you for watching and trade smart.